Hey, what is up everybody? My name is Starlord. I hope that you're all having a fantastic day. I know I am. I'm really happy today. Very smiley. Feeling very, very positive about my future. And uh, yeah, I hope that all of you guys are too. I hope that you're all having a good day. You're smiling. And uh, you know, if you are having a bad day, I hope that it gets better because you deserve to have a good day. Uh, but anyway, in today's video, what we're actually going to be talking about is a grappling hook slash grapple backpack for Fortnite Battle Royale. This is going to be a very interesting video and I know you guys like these type of videos where we kind of talk about items and everything like that and kind of just talk, speculate and kind of discuss our own opinions and if you guys have any opinions that differ from my opinions then please comment them down below. I check the comments and uh, yeah you never know I might agree with them, I might like them and all of that kind of stuff. Uh, now, before we do actually get into today's video, guys, please do not forget to leave a like. Let's see if we can hit around about 600 likes. That would be really awesome and it would help me out a lot. And also, go and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Fortnite videos just like this one here today. You would be missing out on the channel, guys. Just telling you that right now. If you don't subscribe, you're missing out. Uh, but anyway, like I was saying, grapple backpacks, grappling hooks in Fortnite Battle Royale. So basically, this is an idea that I've seen around for a while and like some of you guys know, a lot of ideas that the fans have for this game actually do get put into the game. Like, just off the top of my head, I can think of four ideas that fans had for this game that got put into it. I mean, that's just off the top of my head, such as, you know, the friendly traps being blue so that you can actually tell which one's your friends and which one's yours. Haunted Hills was a fan idea. Cops and robbers kind of concept art for the uh, for the skins was a fan idea, and so was the Tomato Town head. And uh, yeah, it seems that Fortnite Battle Royale developers noticed that you know when a fan has a good idea, they want to somehow implement that into the game. And there's been a lot of talk about a grappling hook hopefully coming to Fortnite Battle Royale in the future. And honestly, I have so much ideas for this that I wanted to share them in today's discussion video because I know, like I said, you guys love these type of videos. So let us talk about it. So obviously, you guys have seen it from the thumbnail itself. You know, it looks really cool. It fits with the whole style of Fortnite Battle Royale. It looks very cartoony. And it's basically a gun that has this kind of like kind of contraption on the end of it that grapples onto items, objects, or buildings or something like that, you know? So basically, you can travel long distances with this item. Now the really cool thing about this is that it would work for Fortnite very well because Fortnite is a very fast paced kind of game and with a grappling hook you know it's obviously to get you to one place and the other very very quickly and that's just kind of why it would work so well. Now it has been rumored that the next season that little thing in Dusty Divot which is ironically in the middle of the map is possibly going to be a bomb that destroys the whole map. Now, what happens if that map gets destroyed? I would say it turns to dust, you know? So basically, the next map that we might see in Fortnite may just be a desert map, which means that a lot of the technology that we see here in the game today, such as jetpacks, will no longer be available. They will be obsolete. And one thing that we could replace the jetpacks really easily would be a grappling hook, or especially a grapple backpack, you know? It would work really well. So basically, this grappling hook could be used to travel long distances, and you could even put it down as a zip line. So let's say, for example, um, we have a grappling hook, right? It's a backpack that runs out of ammo. So basically, like the jetpack, the more you use it, it'll eventually run out and destroy itself. Well, think of that like the grappling hook. You know, you can use it as much as you want, but the minute that it is completely depleted to the end of its lifeline, it will destroy from your back. So what would be really cool is that if you wanted to use it for a one-time use, let's say, for example, you didn't want to use it all through the game, what you could do is you could basically pull out this, like, retractable pole, you could stick it into the ground, you could shoot the grapple hook to the other side of a building or a very far distance that you would like to travel to and use it as a zip line. But if you didn't want to use it as a zip line, you could just use it as a grappling hook. So, you know, you could run around, you could shoot it on top of a building, it would zip line you up to the building, and then you could shoot it onto, let's say, for example, an item that is very far away, it would grab the item and bring it back to you. So, for example, you know, if you saw a guy going for a scar and you wanted it and you had a grapple backpack, what you would do is shoot the scar before the guy gets it, it grabs it and brings it back to you. So then, yes, you have the item itself and you're able to actually kill them. Very cool, I know. It will be very difficult for the devs to actually implement this into the game, but 
I don't think it's impossible. Now, other than that, it'd be really cool if, you know, you could actually grapple people too, such as, you know, if your teammate's down, you could actually grapple him towards you, or you could go and grapple towards him, and you'd be able to heal him a little bit quicker. And, um, yeah, there's just a lot of uses for this actual item itself that I think would be really interesting to work around with, and especially with the Playground LTM mode. I mean, just think about it. I mean, once the map does destroy, if it does destroy, which, you know, the Fortnite developers do somehow want to make a new map, I mean, that bomb in the middle would be a perfect example of doing this, you know? If the whole map goes to a desert kind of looking map, uh, basically, you know, you would have, for example, cowboys and Indians. You would have, you wouldn't have robots anymore. Like, everything would be like Mad Max, you know? So, when the jetpack is no longer available, it would make sense for them to introduce a weapon that is more suited to the theme of the map than you know, having just a normal jetpack kind of be able to use in the game and stuff like that. So it makes sense for them to introduce a grappling hook or a grapple backpack. And uh, I just think it would be really good. I mean, honestly, guys, if you like what I'm saying right now, if you do agree on most of what I've said, please comment down below. I would love to know. Personally, I don't think it will be too overpowered. I mean, obviously, while you're gra grappling, I don't think you should be able to shoot, okay? So when you're grappling up to a building, you shouldn't be able to shoot, but, you know, it'll grapple you up all the way, and then you can build up on top of the building or whatever. But I do think if that if you ever use it as the one-time use, which is using it as a zip line, I think on a zip line, you should be able to shoot. So basically, you're holding on with one hand to kind of slide down, and then you've got the scar kind of shooting. But obviously, you wouldn't have very accurate aim because, you know, a part of using this grapple uh, zip line would be that, yes, you do get to one place to another very quickly, but because of this, because of this awesome thing that you can do, you do have a weakness, which is your accuracy won't be that good. Um... Honestly, I just think this is really cool. I think it's a great idea. I did see a guy actually comment about this on the Reddit page the other day, and his ideas wasn't really that great. He didn't really give you that much uh, kind of background information on what he would hope this item would do, and... I have a lot of ideas for this game, and honestly, I genuinely do think that if Fortnite developers or Epic Games would say to me tomorrow, Ben, we think that you have a very creative mind, and it definitely would suit Fortnite Battle Royale, would you like to have an internship or some kind of job at Epic Games where, you know, you kind of throw ideas at us, uh, kind of, you know, do all of that, I would take it in a heartbeat, because I love this game, I think that there's so much that they can do with it, and I think that they're only just touching... That, like, they're only just touching the base of it. Like, they can go so much better with this game. Uh, such as, you know, the shopping carts and everything. That was such an out-of-the-world idea. Like, who even thought about that? It must have got, like, praise in the workplace for thinking about those shopping carts, you know? Uh, so, anyway, Grappling Hook, guys, what do you think? Would you like to see it in Fortnite Battle Royale, or would you kind of think it's a little bit too iffy? Or is it too early to tell? I don't know. But what I'm going to do is, on my Twitter, I will actually at Fortnite Game and say, you know... Fortnite uh, introducing grappling hooks into the game, blah, 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 all that kind of stuff. And if you want to, go over, like the tweet, and retweet the tweet. Because, honestly, the more exposure it actually gets would be very interesting. And I know for a fact that a lot of people would really like this item. Obviously, there's going to be a couple that don't like it. But, you know, I would think that would be, the like, the minority, I guess. So, yeah. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. I do hope that you enjoyed this little uh, kind of information, kind of speculation, kind of idea video. I know a lot of people really like these. So, if you want to see me do more of these, comment down below and tell me. And uh, also, before I do end the video, I would like to say that I've just recently started streaming on Facebook. I know, right, Facebook, what is all that about? But basically, Facebook is a really good place to actually live stream on these days, and I've got a really good deal going over on there. And uh, basically, what I would like to do is that every two days on Facebook, I will be basically giving away 1,000 V-Bucks worth of money. So I won't actually give away V-Bucks. I'll be giving you guys like $15 so that you guys can actually buy V-Bucks for yourselves. If that sounds like something that you're interested in, watching me play gameplay live with my face cam on, with my son in the background playing with me, um, well basically go into the link to below, there is a Facebook link, click on it and it'll take you to my Facebook page. All you have to do is like the page or follow it and uh, yeah, just wait until I go live and you never know, every two days I'll be giving away money so that you guys can actually get uh, some V-Bucks. So best of luck to all you guys who do that and uh, yeah, I really hope that you guys follow me over there because 
I really, really wish I would get a bigger community there. So, yeah. yeah but anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. Have an awesome day. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.